We are at the Apex Gym in, where are we? Lapote, Texas. And this is a water bed. This shit's actually kind of cool, but I'm gonna end it because we gotta get our workout in. That shit's nice. It's like a water bed, it's just like the whole time. But yeah, we're here at Apex Gym. It's really freaking cool right now. The whole dark aesthetic. You know how Elf Land is like dark bathroom, dark hallway, lights in the hallway. Like this is like times 10. Very, very dark, like consistently dark throughout the whole entire place. So, and plus it's cold. Uh, I wanted to go to an inside gym. I know that Elfland has like an inside portion, but it gets crazy during the winter time. So we are gonna make our way over to the, we already kind of checked it out. It's like a bodybuilding section. And that's kind of where I think I'm gonna spend the most of my time. Have my drink with me again. This flavor is so good. Let's explore. I literally accidentally walked into a room. I was like, oh my God, what is this? It was their break room and there was a poor little employee sitting in there. He's like, it's the break room. I'm in a little, what would you call this? A pod room? I don't know, it's just a tiny little room. A couple things here, but I'm warming up a little bit and just so happens that the day we visited Apex is on another push day. I will be hitting triceps and shoulders again. I know it's a little redundant because I think we just did that the last video. But new environment though, so we're gonna test it out. I'm gonna start with my triceps. There looks like there's some cable things over there. This is the main area, but then hopefully for like shoulders and other things, we'll make our way over to the cool bodybuilding area. So, yes. Wait, 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 wait. Right off the bat, along with like the aesthetic, the fact that right behind me, there are literally five cable sec like setups where like two on each side and then there's like a lat um, or a pull up thing right on it. There's five of them. You don't see that in gyms. I just think that's really cool. There's like a bunch of Smith machines. There's seven of them. Meanwhile, my home gym, there's two. Yeah. I just think that's really cool. There's just so much here. And this one even has like a thing out of order on this side, but I'm like, you got like 13 more to choose from. I don't know if this is just placebo from being in a cool gym and being just like mesmerized by everything, but this is so smooth right now. And it very well could just be placebo that I'm like, oh my God. They're only four months old, so that's what he meant by that. That's crazy. He said that they're like, 50,000 square feet right now, and they want to expand and do like outdoor stuff come 2024 and go to like 112,000 square feet. So they're like trying to double this place. I just think it's cool. If it wasn't so far away, I would want to come here all the time. But yep, just doing more tricep stuff, kind of the same thing as last time you saw me. But yeah, I'm excited. I kind of want to take some pictures here too. I remember when the bartender said it's on the you make me want to fall in love The weather felt better When we were in it together Oh, I miss the way We used to talk about nothing oh, I hate to say I should have seen it coming Last I'm about to do a little uh, shoulder thing I wanted a chair There's no chairs over there like the little chair that I like, we're gonna see if it's over here, but this is the hallway leading into the cool bodybuilding section. So let's go. Do I look huge? They look uh, smaller. So like even though it's a 15, I feel like I'm doing like, oh my God, like it looks like I should be doing more. Like I almost picked up the 20s cause these just look small. I'm just weak. <laughs> womp womp. I'm gonna do some overhead dumbbell press. Not normally in the agenda. A lot of you may not know, but before 
the surgery. I actually used to incline press. I think I got up to 60s. There's a video, I should find it. <laughs> And it was kind of cool because there was like a person in the background that saw me doing the 60s and he was like Or maybe it was 55s. I don't remember. The video will tell us the truth like legs yeah this is like the leg section hamstring curls or something I don't know I'm just trying to look at it quickly over here also they have their squat racks and it's like you called it multifunctional which I think is really cool I've only been to one gym that had these in person like I know like crunch has some of them I haven't been to a crunch though there was a gym up in Michigan that had stuff like this but they didn't have nearly as many they have five it's got a squat rack and it pulls out into a deadlift platform. But then like, also I've been at a gym where they had these type of squat racks and if there wasn't a bench available out in the main room, you would pull up a like actual bench from like this area, pull it up and you could even bench there. I know benching in a squat rack is looked down upon like curling in a squat rack, but the gym that I used to work at was like powerlifting too and like they did it all the time. So honestly, if you needed to, you could make a bench out of this shit and it's, I don't know, it just works. They got the leg press. I like the free weight stuff. The free weight loaded machines, I think are very, very cool. Very old school, but yeah. So, mm. I have, actually, you know what? Never mind. coming soon. The increments of five, but they start at like two and a half. I don't know, weird, cool though. But there's this one, I wonder what this is. Is that to like stop it or something? Yeah. Possibly. I think that's cool. I'm gonna do one more thing for shoulders. It's gonna be my, I like the easy bar. It, is that the crinkle bar? The one that's like bendy? Yeah. So I'm gonna use the easy bar and not a trainer. I'm not a trainer. <laughs> the crinkle bar. Just do some upright rows for a little more shoulder action. This is like the main area, no longer in the bodybuilding area. Yeah, dumbbells. This is thick. I can keep my shit together, safe, keep you. Can't debate that. Don't want shit to get better. Cause it made me forget it all and I hate that. Last night, everything was easy. I'm done. I did a couple sets. I did three, I think. So, this is the end of the workout. It was kind of cool exploring everything. All in all, out of 10, I think this gym is like high nine. I'm gonna be one of those weirdos that's like, 9.753. I'll be like, 9.8. I really like it. I was just saying, um, before we came over here to close everything out, uh, the only thing I didn't like, the nitpicky thing, literally doesn't even matter. The bar on the easy bar was like a little thick and weird. It was hard for me to like put my hands where I wanted them to be, but still got a good workout in though. So that is gonna be the end of our video. All in all, if you guys are able to visit this gym, it's called Apex Gym. Yeah, go ahead and give it a visit. They're only gonna get better from here. If this were closer to me, I think this would be a gym I would wanna go to a lot. So yeah, if you like the video, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe.